a big round of applause for Carl and Robin, who from the Welsh Ambulance Service, who I've just nominated, <laughs> to give me a hand. Gentlemen, if you want to just take up your position, if that's right. Hopefully you'll be able to see what's going on. I'm going to do the whole thing one-handed. That was a great lunch, Colin. It was, uh, it was really nice. I wonder if we're going to have a quiet afternoon. You're driving. Who knows what's going to happen, eh? Uh, okay. Ah, oh, mate, I've got a call. Yep. Yep, we are available. Okay, so that's a 45-year-old in cardiac arrest at the Royal Commonwealth Gym. Yep, we should be en route. Uh, two minutes, we'll be there. Put your driving to the test, Colin. Cool, here we go. Got my seatbelt on, good. Okay, Colin, so it sounds like a good going cardiac arrest. There's a bystander paramedic off-duty crew on the scene. The plan will be the usual. I'll be the team leader. If you want to focus on getting the autopulse deployed, and we'll take it from there, but we are in a pavement to PCI window, if that's okay. Happy with that? Okay, let's go. So we've pre-allocated some of the roles. Hi, guys. How's it going? My name's Richards. I'm one of the doctors on PIU today. I've got Colin here. How are you getting on? Hi, hey, yeah, we're in uh, cycle three of CPR. Okay. Good job. Okay, guys, you got your metronome on. Yes. Carl, I just want you to focus on good quality CPR. And Robin, you've got the airway there. Is that okay? Yes. What we're going to do, Colin's just ready for the auto pulse, and you're counting as well. Excellent. Okay, so that's the end of the cycle. So what we'll do is we'll just, in a minute, do a rhythm check and see where we're going. Is that okay? Okay, Carl, so just want to stop for two seconds. Okay, we're still in VF. Continue CPR. I'm just going to select up my energy, 150 joules. Just want to keep going with your CPR call. That's excellent. In a minute, everyone stand clear, thanks. Shock delivered and straight back on the chest. Okay, guys, so what we're going to do is just get the auto pulse deployed. What that means is when I say stop, Carl, you're going to lift the patient forward. You're going to lift his hand above his head, and I'm going to take the other hand. And Robin, if you just want to move to the side, is that okay? And the aim will be just to minimize the interruption to get the auto pulse deployed. Colin, you ready? Okay. Right, guys, on three. One, two, three. Excellent. Okay, guys, well done. So, Colin, if you just want to think about getting advanced airway secured just now, Robin, if you could just set that up with the end tidal, and Carl, could you just get some IV access in that left arm? Would that be okay? Okay, so that goes in. So, team, it sounds like this person was 45. They were on the treadmill. They had some chest pain, and then they're in VF. So we need to think about reversible causes, but coronary artery occlusion is definitely up there. Once Colin's secured the airway, we'll continue to the end of this cycle, and we'll then we'll have another rhythm check. If we're still in VF at that point, we might think about doing a pavement to PCI option on this patient. Okay, so you've got end tidal. Colin's bagging okay. Excellent. Okay, guys. I'm just going to let you... We'll just do a rhythm check in a minute, and then we'll make a decision. Is that okay? Right, that's the end of our two-minute cycle now. Colin, just want to pause the auto pulse for me. We're still in VF. Okay, we're just going to charge up again. Shock delivered. Okay, guys, I'm going to let Colin take over, and we're going to get the carry sheet deployed. I'm just going to make a phone call to the pavement to PCI hotline. Is that okay? Oh, hi there. Is that pavement to PCI? It's Richard here. Yep, we've got a 45-year-old male who's collapsed in the gym. Refractory VF after third shock. We can be with you in 15 minutes. Can we have a go for pavement to PCI, please? Yep, that's great. Thanks very much. We'll see you shortly. Let's say Colin has instructed the guys to deploy the carry sheet. 
The patient's now secured. And what we're going to do now, having got the green light to pavement to PCI, secured IV access, got a secure airway, we can continue resuscitation and shocking en route. You happy? I'll carry that. Okay, so we're just going to aim. Everyone got their positions. Okay, we'll just leave the, leave the airway for now. And we'll just go back towards the ambulance guys, if that's okay. And the CPR will just continue as we're on the move. And that's us in the ambulance. Well done.